Welcome back everybody. Hope you are having a wonderful day. Uh, let's talk to Wild. The Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Uh, let's talk. Karlak's fires raged in Baldur's Gate before she escaped to Avernus. As my source told it. And she was planning to return. One of the Archdevil Zariel's own. Chaos incarnate. A devil with pure fire for a heart. I made my way to Avernus to stop her. She fled from my reach. Even climbed aboard the Mind Flayer ship as it screeched through the hells. I followed in close pursuit. All right. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking. The damage she might be doing. A powerful friend with a keen interest in... Privacy. I'm sworn to say no more. All right. All right. What else is on your mind? A most vicious one, in fact. It's made from pure bloodstone, carved from the Galena Mountains just north of the Moon Sea. A reminder that sometimes blood must be shed and sacrifices must be made. Ah, but that story is reserved for lifetime friends and karma days. All right. Tiny grooves spider across the ice surface. It resembles a sending stone used to confer with distant contacts. A sending stone? <laughs> Nothing so special, I assure you. His breathing quickens, his jaw tenses. Will is keeping something from you. All right. A strange sensation courses through you. And your companion's mind unfolds, secrets half revealed. All right. Should I? What are you? Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. Your right eye vibrates and a woman's voice echoes in your head. I have a sweet tooth and devils on the menu. All right. Beyond the voice you find only shadow. A piece of Will's mind locked away from intruders. Keep out of my mind. I told you the eyes are rock, nothing more. And that's the end of it. All right. Fine. No need to be so grumpy. Never a dull moment. Uh, I guess I can't find uh, either way. Let's go back. Um, leave camp. So. I need a shovel to dig this up. Uh, so let's let's put a let's put a marker here. Uh, dig. Right? Here, we'll say dig. So we'll come back for this one. Let's jump. Here. Alright. Nice. Alright. Let's check what that's about. Secluded curve. Mark on. Uh, find a way to remove. Let me save it just in case. I need a quick word. Shh. Listen. Let's listen. A sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A harpy's charm.
so that mm, advantage and this one as well nice nice success a suffocating yearning suddenly fades as the spell breaks you are free get back is a trip just a bit of water. I only want to listen. Just a little closer. Nope. Are we gonna fight the harpy? Yes, everything's gonna be fine once I get there. Okay. Ooh. What? what is this? What happened? I will have your head happy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Why is she being lured? Okay, finally. Uh, heal a creature you can see. Let's do healing for everybody. Can only be cows outside of a combat. So who should I heal? Okay, first of all. Uh, let's do tactical view. So this guy, right? Uh, weapon enchantment. I got okay how about rush let me examine her uh, multi attack cleared okay opportunity attack threaten there is no resistance right okay nice so let's do damage 3 to 30 let's do that I missed it damn it Okay, let's do Shield of Faith. Uh, to him? No. She's... Uh, I think I need to save the child. Okay. And... Then I'll take this. Uh, let's do this one. Level 2 spell. Uh, let's me see if I can... Okay, a little bit too far. She's concentrating, right? Nice. And let me dip. Must be a dippable surface. Can I dip it into the candle? Do I have a candle? We ha I have, right? So let's do Gale. Use how to do that in the Sure, let's do that. I coat my weapon. Let's go here. And let's go here. Alright. Uh, for her, we'll also go here. Ah! Let's go above here. Okay. Why am I being lured? 
Oh, damn it. Uh. What is this? I will nice. Have your head, Harpy. Stay out of my head. Oh no. Nice. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Thank you. Nice. Uh, can't control. Okay. So first of all, I need to save my guy. And I'll do rush attack. Nice. Off balance. And... Why he's being lured also? Why is everybody being lured? Oh. This is you right. for what you are. Man, I'm so close to dying. Good. Thank you. Okay, so Uh, first of all, I want to do second wind. Let's heal myself. She's only one, right? Yeah. Thank you. And... Let me see. Attack one enemy on one hit. You can use force maneuver on an ally, increasing their movement speed. Astral knowledge, gain proficiency. Yeah, let's do maneuvering attack. Finally, see you now for what you are. Let's do that. Uh, action surge. Uh, brace. Sacrifice 6 meter movement speed for the rest of your turn. Roll melee damage twice and use the highest result. Yeah, let's do that. Alright. And then we'll do maneuvering attack. Uh, let's kill her. Nice. Alright. So that guy is dead. Uh, Shadow Heart. Uh, ranged. Yeah, let me do ranged. Can I? Yes, I can. Uh, okay, it's a little bit outside. Can I... Okay, oh, this one is here, right? So, let me do... Too close, okay. Off balance, nice. Let's push her. Nice. Uh, which board false life? I want to do acid arrow. I mean, it's fine. Nice. Uh, 
Entries. Bonus action, I can't do anything, huh? Uh, can I... Not enough movement. Let's go a little bit ahead. However much, right? Let's go here. Okay, nice. So... First and foremost... This is bonus action, right? Let's heal up a bit. Nice. Ice knife. Create water. Uh, ranged attack. The best damage would be chromatic orb. How much she has? Two, right? I think it should be fine if I just do main attack. Or I can do topple. Let's do topple. Critical miss, come on. Uh, can I not do bonus attack? Okay, she will. Okay, miss, nice. Okay, she's done. Ah! All right. Rally. Not her. Her. Let us cheat death. All right. So she get plus eight, right? And then let's do a range attack. Disarming range, maneuvering ranged. A little bit too far. Let's come here. Uh, ranged, maneuvering range. Nice. Concentration is gone. And what is this? Force maneuver. Alright, fine. Uh, thunder wave. She's still doing that, right? Uh, sleep. Let's put her to sleep. And her also. Nice. 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 They are both to sleep. Okay, so can I disengage through improvised melee weapon? Nice. Ice knife. I mean, it's a little too far, don't you think? Uh, I can do double. I can I can do the distant spell, right? Increase my yeah. Nice. Let's do that. Nice. Woo! Done. Aha! There is a chest. Uh, I can do a short rest, right? Rested enough. Now, forward. Uh, let's take what she has. What she has, she has. <sighs> they don't have anything. Okay, where is the boy? He is here, right? Talk to him. Good moment to talk. Uh, are they gone? 
Yep. No. Yes. I mean, I don't know. Th that's what the voice said. I almost got to the nest, but the singing. I need to get back. Mo will be so mad. <sighs> Wait, um, you should meet Mo. She'll be grateful you helped me. Sure. Find a boy called Donny. Tell him you want to see the dragon's lair. All right. Mm, is that all here? All right. I think I need to do a long rest. Let's go to the camp. We do need to do uh Let's go to this. All the supplies are here. Okay, so this will give me more ranged attack, huh? Let's see how much I got. Uh, SD. Better not be cursed. How much supply I got? 94, right? I think it's fine. Okay, yes. Uh, can I talk to anybody? Does anybody has question mark? Point. Ah, she has, right? Okay. And they have, they have, they have. Everybody has. Let's talk to the Shadow Heart. Finally, some good fortune. Come morning, we know what to do. The sooner we find the Druid House in, the better. I can't wait to get rid of this thing in my head. Head to Baldur's Gate. Someone's waiting for me. Let a girl have some secrets. Was there anything else? Heh. <laughs> uh, no. Let's not do that. How are you feeling? Safe. These parasites are proving suspiciously benign. But suppose I turn. What would you do? I'd just kill you. Yeah. Anyway, get some rest. Try not to dream about tying me up. <laughs> Something the matter. What can I say? They were eye catching. Consider me an art lover. Mm hmm. Uh. Let me see what happens. Okay. I'm not sure if this is a good idea, but let's see. Must we? No harm in a little mystery, don't you think? Uh... Easy is often less interesting. Besides, we've plenty of reason to rely on each other already. You can't confide in just anyone about a monster in your head. That is true. 
Thank you. I'm sure we'll get along perfectly well. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's just leave her for now. Perfectly fine. Let's talk to him, Astarian. You know, I've been thinking, reflecting on what tomorrow might bring. When we find the druid, will mm -hmm. he know how to bring the worm under control? Will this little adventure of ours be over? Good. I don't want you to run off just yet. Mm -hmm. You're quite the ally after all. Traversing Avernus, surviving the crash, surviving everything that's followed. I'm not easily impressed by people, but you're stronger than I gave you credit for. Mm -hmm. You have your charms more than you think. All right. The smile on his pretty lips is a touch too composed. A bit too perfect. He may not mean a word he says. Oh. You're no fun. <laughs> Sleep tight. I'll see you later. I'm sure. <laughs> a fine evening. Don't you think? Yep. The moonlight shines warmly on us. The breeze caresses our faces. Hideous. All of it. Would that I were doing battle up there, among the tears. Look above. Watch the moon cross the sky. The tears follow behind it. Rocky bodies tumbling through the sea of night. One of them is my crash. Clear. Your curiosity is to be commended. Githyanki are hatched in crashes all throughout realm space. Clear is one of many. It's there I first saw a Kithrak mount a red dragon. Where I slit my cousin's throats at the Vash's command. But enough of this. You are wasting your resting time. Come dawn. We resume our search for a crash. Mm -hmm. The Githyanki people have a word for men like the Blade of Frontiers. Shalak. Roughly translated, idealist do-gooder. <laughs> or better yet, benevolent burden. His confidence is an asset. His pursuit of valor, not so much. Entirely. I was as devoted to my studies as I was to my training. Each crash contains a safest purification device. So I learned from the writings in the Kaleer Library. All right. The library was a gift from Vlakith herself that we may gain total understanding. Countless scholars roam the astral sea and beyond. Observing the ways of our lessers, exploring planes so distant, order turns to chaos and cold fires rage. The planes are ever quaking and their peoples ever shifting. The Githyanki possess an eternity of knowledge. Yet we still collect more, infinities upon infinities. Yes, in great detail. It starts with a fever and memory loss. Then you start to hallucinate. Your hair falls out. <laughs> and you bleed from every orifice. Your bones will change form. Your jaw will split to allow room for four great tentacles. All skin will turn to gore and be shed to reveal new flesh underneath. Then you have ceased to exist and a mind flayer is born. All right. Words forged in steel. May your actions express the same metal. 
We must find my kind and be rid of the parasite. It's as simple as that. The first symptoms should have long since started, though. That is what puzzles me. So something is different, I guess. Yes, if you give it no further thought. But anomalies lead to surprises. Bad surprises. Besides, what hasn't happened may yet come to pass. Alright, let's talk to him. While. I wonder. Tingle runs through your head and down to your feet. Ah, there it is. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made fast friends, it would seem. How do you feel? <laughs> Surprising is just the word, isn't it? Before yeah. the Elithids' unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair few fiends. The tadpoles weakened me, suppressed greater talents, but beyond that, have showed no signs of turning. No nausea, no pain, not even a hot flash. Indeed. Perhaps the worm's vat was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. Yep. Or perhaps the tadpoles are merely on holiday. <laughs> we could conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Dawn comes sooner than we think. All right. I think we are done with the we will talk to them later but let's go and rest hey we have we can keep it okay let me just check if I keep all of them in the if I keep all of them in the travelers chest does it work Oh, I guess not. Let's just let's just rest. It's fine. Yep. Full rest. Ooh, what's he doing? <sighs> what? What was he doing? Hello? So, we're traveling with the famed Blade of Frontiers. I feel safer already. Camp supplies. Okay, nice. All right. Path lies before. Let's go back. All right, Emerald Grove. Let's go back and wrap up those quest. I'll be keeping an eye. Hello? Oh, I can go from here. Polish dagger, ribcage. Wish I had a bag of holding. That's all here. Okay, let's go then.
Yeah, we can go from here, right? We'll find a shovel and come back for this later. So, Gith, aren't you worried your kind will punish you for consorting with us? My name is Lazelk Chucky, and my kin will understand my need for servants. <laughs> they will help you, but only if. Hmm? Who's this my, guy? My, my, what manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. Who are you? What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormier, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Charmed, I'm sure, in more ways than one. We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. What? What the hell? There. Middle of somewhere. The house of hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. All right. Call it a ninth sense. Huh. Aha. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Come now, why play hard to get when you're in deep over your tadpole head? So he knows about our condition. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. What's the catch? Okay, let me... Take all the time you need, but make up your mind before you're counting down with tentacles. Try to cure yourself, shop around, beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, yes. that's when you'll come knocking on my door. He sounds like a sadist. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. I'll be around. Watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice, juicy brain. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. What the fuck was that? When you pull the lock. 
Okay, so find Donnie. And we have the hunt down Karlak. Uh, find the Githyanki patrol, search for signs of a Githyanki creature nearby the mountain pass. Find the night song, druid Halcyon, save the Halcyon. Okay, nice. So, I think we need to talk to... Return to Zevlar, right? Okay. Let's finish that up. talk to them you ever scare me like that again and I'll feed you to a knoll mom I'm fine stop it our little hellion told us what happened thank you don't know what we do without her uh, let's see I did, but I was robbed. You wouldn't know anything about that, would you? Comida? Why would Mary. I? All we can offer is our thanks. Arabella? Thank you for helping me. Arabella is safe. Her parents are grateful for our intervention. Uh, Comira's locket grants us the ability to cast dancing lights. Okay. Then I think this one we can give it to locket, right? It's a locket. Yeah. Let's give it to her, Shadow Heart. Okay. And we got some ring, I guess. Anyway, all right, let's go. So this one is done. Let me see. I don't think he has the the hollow. Talk to talk. I need to talk to who? Donny, right? Let me see. Talk to him again. Uh, hey, are you here to trade or? No. Hi, I guess. Let me see again what he has. Uh, hey, are you here to trade or? Okay, he doesn't have the. He doesn't have the shovel. So let's leave. Hi, I guess. We need to talk to Donnie, right? That that girl said. Let me see. Explore the powers your parasite gives you. We use the power of our parasite to exert an influence beyond ourselves. How far does it? We found a special parasite like our own. We were drawn to its potential. How to do that? Save the refugees, investigate the beach. A child named Donnie. Okay, so I think. And save Arabella is done. Uh, let's do the completed. Where is the Donnie? Amek. Those dirt kisses would let us die for the sake of their bloody grove. Uh, this is Donnie, right? Okay. Okay, got it. Watching his hands, you realize he's mining opening something. Nice. 
Nice. Got to keep watch. But it's so bright and noisy here. Want to be back in the hideout. No one's stopping yet. He's getting free. He nods, then reaches for a concealed hatch. <laughs> All right. His eyes flicker to yours for an instant, then away, as if it hurts to look at you. Okay. Let's go down. Nice. Tiffling hideout. At the ready. Hey, there is a chest there. How can I get there? Can I jump? Let me try. Z. It is a little bit too far. How can I get there? I wonder if there is a way to like make jump further. Okay, fine. Let's just go. go up here let me check what's here oh there is a hole can't use this okay chasm mole here well, look who's come to visit. My kids say you've been busy since you got here. I heard you helped Melly with that locket. I owe you for that. Mercon says you got him out of a tight spot with some harpies. Gotta say, I'm impressed. Yep. You saved Arabella from the druids. Don't know what those bastards would have done. And thanks for going easy on Sylphie. Not many marks would have done the same. We're saving up for a better hideout when we get to Boulder's Gate. Okay. Why? You planning on telling me stealing is wrong? Nope. Hey. Won't turn down free money. I've got operating costs you wouldn't believe. Come see me in the city sometime, huh? I'll repay this and then some. See you around, maybe. I have something to ask. You came! I have... Here! Mole said I should thank you properly for the harpies. Okay. So I wrote you a story. It's about you. I hope you like it. Mikon story. Okay. Let's see what he wrote for us. All right, nice. Uh, out of sight, out of mind. All right, I can't take that. Breathe deep <laughs> and move. I need new pockets to pick. I guess I can't go up. 
right? Okay, let's just go back. How come I can't? What is happening? Okay. I really can't jump, huh? How do I... Can I go here? And then here? Let's try that. So if I do Z... Not enough space, not enough space. Not enough space. The path is interrupted. Not enough space. Not enough space. I can't go there. Alright, let's just go up. There's nothing. Alright, let's save it here. Uh, who was the... What's this flat rock? Oh. Let's take this tar on. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. Alright, fine. Uh, we need to talk to. What? You rolled a critical what? What was that? You all rolled a critical fail on a perception check. Alright, fine. Swing and swing and carry it. Ah! And again. Swing and uh, where do I need to talk to that guy? Zevlor, right? Yeah, here. Let's go talk to Zevlor. Uh, I can... Let me go check here. Oh, you! You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Get out of the way! She didn't kill your brother, Arka. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. I'm not afraid. Chosen by the Absolute, I am. I'm blessed. Who's the Absolute? Oh, I'll bless you, all right. Looks like the Absolute sent me a protector. You're gonna kill him, too? You! Move! Let's do that. We will do friends. And advantage. We'll do everything. I think we are good. You're right. I wish you weren't. I really do. Mm-hmm. Damn you. Damn it! But why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? If you believe anything the beast tells you, you're an idiot. It's all right, Arka. Let's go. I'm gonna bite the heads off your kids. And your birdies, and your dogs! Gil, what do you want? Believe it or not, but I witnessed a similar standoff back at the Yawning Portal. Of course, an establishment like that invites all sorts of outlandish entertainments. <laughs> What's the Yawning Portal? An inn in Waterdeep. Ooh, never a dull moment there. Adventurers come from all over Faerun to try their luck down the well. Leads into the under mountain, you see, full of death, danger, and vast amounts of treasure. 
Hard to resist. Oh, a drow, a dragonborn, and a cleric of Cyric walk into a bar. Your standard fare. <laughs> Maybe someone was cheating at cards. Maybe it was some weird lover's quarrel. In any case, out came the crossbow, and a hush fell over the entire room. stood up and yelled, Shadow Dark Ale for everyone. The crowd cheered. The tension drained into five dozen tankards, and soon all was well again. In a place like the Yawning Portal, the most powerful magic is calling for a round of drinks. <laughs> Mind you, all I did was call for ale, but you went and stood in front of that crossbow. Well, I'll drink to that. All right, so I think I can. Friendly looking shadow. I can take all that. Let me out, you bunch of softies! Okay, let's see. What you messing with my cage for? It's too late to make friends, warg me. My tribe's coming. They're gonna burn this pretty place for the glory of the absolute and hang you by your guts. Goddess, we're burning her name across the face of the world we are. The absolute is gold from the sky she is. The blessing in the storm and the storm itself. My tribe can tell you everything there is to know. Absolute blessed one of our own. Priestess Gut. Got a whole lab set up. Cooks up potions that fix our lads, no matter how much of a beating they take. Could probably stick your head back on if someone was to chop it off. <laughs> Mighty Booyog. Booyog. The goblin word for magic. Primitive to a fault, but not entirely without merit. Get me out of here, and I'll tell you where to find her. Deal? Then hurry up and do it. My tribe ain't as friendly as I am. Uh, stay there for a while. You're gonna be sorry, every last one of you. Stay there for a while. I need to save her, right? So what they say? We learned that goblin tribe is dealing with goblins, but this might be a fine goblin priestess. Save goblin Saza if we break her out. I think. Yeah, stay there for a while, okay? Uh, let's go. We want to talk to. Right. I've got food. Don't be grumpy, Rhoda. We'll get to the soon. I am not grumpy. The scowl on your face would frighten a troll. Let, let me check if he got my show up. I have, well, something close. Does he have my shovel? No. Can I use battle axe? No, right? I guess not. Hammer, housing pipe. I don't know what I'll do for rip cage. Okay, doesn't seem like he has my shovel, which is fine. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. You've had your share. Ooh, who's this Auntie Ethel? Ah, uh, fit isn't the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you came along when you. Oh, there isn't a bit of colour in those cheeks, Pickle. Are you harsh, cold, feverish? Auntie Ethel will sort you out. I've lotions and potions galore. Nice. Please give them to me.
Uh, let me see trade first. Uh, elixir of heal giant strength. Potion of healing. Greater potion of healing. Corneo's grace. Unhampered resistance. While the wielder is not wearing armor, they receive plus two bonus from saving throws. Okay. Bazam, Baldona. Let's take all these. Air Contra, Mugward, Whispered, okay. Uh, 64, right? Uh, we can give her some. Not sure. So. Polish dagger. I guess the dagger is fine. Uh, loot is fine. There was a plate, rope, skull, team cup with a chisel set. Let's give her some books. Ordered. And two more, right? Jug and mug. Okay. Barter. Alright. Oh, nothing as fancy as that. How long until Roland shows off his But I come from a long line of women with a bad hand. At How many people thing. are dumb enough to ask? Aha! <laughs> True. You take a sip of that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. All as right. you down the potion, a comforting warmth spreads through you. Hmm. I swear you're still as peaky looking. No helping it. We're exposed now. Oh, I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. Huh. The wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. <laughs> but worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. What is it, Petal? What's wrong? Die if I met Leroy can reeking of this place. Let me try. Never get the smell out of my clothes. As you recount your I'll adventure, Auntie them. Ethel nods along, her eyes wide. You poor pet! My heart goes out to you truly. I see no sign of a tentacle yet, but that could change in an instant. You need help, serious help. I've ne'er a potion or lotion here that could do it, but yes, I may have something at home. All right. Oh, whatever do you mean, Petal? Oh, where did I put that oak bucket? Ha, I was quite the wild thing back in the day. But I'm afraid that's long past. I'm a simple woman, sweetie. Tea hey, and me, potions are as we'll exciting as it soon. gets for I these old bones. But enough nattering, I'll be heading home shortly. You're an idiot. Here, let me mark it on your map. Nice. Be careful on the road. I'd hate if something happened to you. Take care, Pet. Oh, nice. Potion of greater healing. All right. Okay, let me see what I can make. Antidote. Salts. So I can make sublimes. Salts. And suspensions. Pulling mugwort. Let's just extract all. Right. So I can make an antidote. What does it do? 
So I can make one potion of feather fall. Uh, <laughs> True. Did I make it? Okay, fine. Potion of mind reading. Potion of greater healing. How about... Potion of peerless focus. Uh, resistance fire. Coating, simple toxin. Swords. Alright, fine. Whatever. Let's go. Uh, okay, let's wrap things up here. I'm gonna go talk to... Uh, talk to that guy. Zevral. He's outside, right? Yeah, right? Okay. I'll talk to him and I'd die if I met Leroic and reeking of this place. Never get a smell. But before I do that Burn. Zoru, let me go and see if he has my shovel. Give me my shovel back. Need anything else? Trade. Uh, uh, he has nice. What's going on? Zero. Why can't I get it back? Hello? Trade? Okay. So do I need to trade again? With the shovel? Shovel, shovel, shovel. Where is my shovel? I can't... <sighs> it... How do I get it back? Is there anything I can sell for zero? I guess not. If I put this here and then this here. Oh my goodness, I can't get it back. Wow. Fine, whatever. Let's wrap things up here. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye bye.